everyone welcome back to my channel and anyway I know most of us right now are so uncomfortable because of what is happening all around the world like in just one snap everything has changed we cannot do the things that is like normal before we cannot go out freely we cannot do anything anymore and I mean all we need to do right now is to we need to be safe and keep away from people because that's the safest thing that we can do for each other and we also need to survive anyway I know this thing we're gonna end so if you're lucky enough to have the requirements or like the gadgets or the equipments that you're going to use to have an online job then like go for it because like we don't know when this thing we're gonna what we're gonna end we don't know so we don't know until when we can earn some money or what so yeah it's 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 not really clear as of now but one thing is for sure we need to help each other so right now I'm going to share to you guys what are the the processes okay what are the things that you are going through you need to go through not going through you need to go through if you want to apply as an ESL teacher here in Akadzo where I'm working at right now so yeah if you want to know about the requirements and the qualifications so make sure to watch this video over here I was able to discuss all the question I mean the requirements and the equipments that you need to know so the first thing that you need to do is you need to sign up you need to do the online application you need to fill in the basic information that they need to know about you so yeah we have there the name the age and also they will require you to send your resume in there so yeah because after that they're going to do some resume screening they will check if you are qualified to be a teacher if you're like a potential teacher for their company and then you just need to wait after you send that anyway I will put the link down below and where you can sign up so check it out in the description box and yeah where am I <laughs> yeah they're going to contact you they're going to contact you and set the schedule for your Skype interview so with regarding to your Skype interview actually I have some if you want to know if you want to know some tips on how to prepare your Skype interview I have this video here so please check it out and yeah in the interview they're going to ask you some questions like tell common questions like tell me about yourself why do you want to know about it why do you want to work with Akad Sok something like that and somehow they're go they are also going to test you I mean your ability in English or your teaching skills strategies and what and also they're going to conduct some tech check during the Skype interview so the speed test they're going to check if your internet is good and qualified for you to work here in Akinsok and they're going to check as well your background your camera your headset if it's working or what so you really need to prepare yourself anyway I discuss it here in my video so please check it out after the Skype interview if you pass it <laughs> so if you pass the Skype interview they will proceed you to the training during the training they're going to discuss the things that you need to know about the Akatsaw what are the things that you need to expect in this kind of job and also they need uh, they're going to instruct you the things that you need to do on the next part which is the demo class the demo class yeah so anyway the training will take at least two to four hours it depends it depends because you're not alone during the training you have some other colleagues as well co-applicants that will be with you during the training so yeah ask anything that you want to know to the trainer and make sure to take down notes and also make sure to remember all the strategies and all the advices that your trainer told you to do so because that is very important during your demo class so I'm talking about the demo class that is the next part actually so during the demo class you're going to show off your skills in teaching because you're going to have a 25 minute class with a student one of uh, yeah with a student with a Chinese student I'm not really sure if it's like a Chinese student right now or like some stuff of staffs of the Arkansas but anyway one thing is for sure they're going to check your ability to teach so yeah so you need to show off your skills in there and you just relax you just need to prepare you just need to prepare I mean it's it's normal to feel 
nervous <laughs> yeah it's normal but yeah anyway i also have some tips over here top 10 tips on how to to pass your demo class so please check it out and i think that will be helpful well after you finish your demo class and if you pass the demo class so congratulations in advance <laughs> yeah so next thing is they actually have right now this is a good program the tesol certificate program so we actually don't have this kind of thing before when I apply in Arkansas but the good thing is right now they have this kind of program so they're going to give you some certificate you need to answer it you need to yeah that's because they require it for all the teachers in Arkansas right now it is required to have some teaching English teaching certificate so yeah it's it's a good opportunity for you to have the TESOL certificate and after that you just need to um to complete the informations on your account and you need to answer some of the questions in there and yeah you're ready to go you are qualified and you're part of Akatsak you're ready to take classes already <laughs> yeah anyway if yeah please let me know if you have some questions or clarifications about the processes that was so short um it depends on how many takes it will take it depends on uh, when they are going to schedule you for your interview or when they are going to schedule you for your demo class so sometimes it would take one week or like yeah lesser <laughs> yeah it will depends but anyway just give it a try you can start and if you really wanted me to if you you have any questions or concerns feel free to comment down below or like feel free to message me and let's help each other well, make sure to check this video over here as well, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!